Hey guys, what is up? This is James and welcome to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can animate any photo, static photo or any static screen record in Adobe Premiere Pro. First, let me give you two examples. This is a static photo and here is an animated photo. And this is a static screen record and here is an animated screen record. Which one do you like the most? Of course, the animated one, right? So today I'm going to show you how you can do that. First, let me show you how you can animate a photo. Just click and drag the photo on your timeline then adjust the length of your photo i'm just keeping it just like that then you need to go to effects panel if you don't see effects panel then you need to go to window and then you have to enable effects panel right and then you have to search for basic 3d just click and drag this effect on top of your video just like that now again go to effects control panel if you don't see again go to window then enable effects control then this panel will appear now go to at the beginning point of your photo and if you want you can just adjust the size of your photo you can see the photo is not filling the whole screen there are some black bars in the right and left side right so i need to just increase the scale a little bit to fill the entire screen just like that now I need to animate, right? So I need to put some keyframe on different properties. First, I need to enable the toggle animation for position. Just click here. Then you need to click on a scale. Then just scroll down and you'll see basic 3D. You need to enable animation for swivel, tilt, and distance to the image. Now you can adjust the beginning position of your image. I am just adjusting the swivel a little bit just like that this is the starting swivel position and if you want you can just increase the distance to the image a little bit just like that and you can adjust the position to fill the entire screen now you need to animate the ending position of your image so just go some frame ahead just like that and then you can edit the swivel and of course you can edit the position now you need to select the ending keyframes and click and drag those keyframes at the end of your photo. If I just play it back, you can see the photo is animating and it is looking so cool, right? Using the similar process, you can edit any screen record. Let me show you. You need to just drag the screen record on your timeline. Again, you need to apply basic 3D effect. Click and drag it on top of your screen record. Then you need to go to effects control, then enable position, scale swivel tilt and distance to image keyframe then adjust the swivel position again adjust the distance to image to fill the entire screen then you can animate the position go few frame ahead then adjust the swivel again and adjust the position again then click and drag those keyframe at the end of your screen record if i just play it back you can see the screen record is looking so interesting so if you want you can just animate your boring photos or the screen record in adobe premiere pro to make it more interesting so that's all for today i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have enjoyed this video or learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you're new to this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro or video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more videos just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye